Hi, this is Bill from VacLab, and today I'd like to talk to you about suction, specifically manufacturers' claims of suction. And to that end, here's something on a DC-25. Turns on a dime, no loss of suction. Here's another claim on a DC-14. Dyson Cyclones don't clog, so Dyson doesn't lose suction. That's pretty laughable in many ways because that makes people think that suction equates to vacuuming power, that high suction means good cleaning. I'm here to show you that suction means very little as far as getting dirt out of your carpet. What I have is the wand from the DC-14 sitting right here and this DC-14 has the highest level of suction I've ever measured, sometimes known as water lift, and I've measured 112 inches with this DC-14 out of that wand end. That is absolutely incredible. That's near central vacuum level. And I have some Quaker Oats here to prove a point. So what I'm going to do is take these oats, take some of them, and I'm going to put a little bunch of them in my hand, right here. You've probably seen this test before. I'm not the only one who's done this on YouTube. And I'm going to insert them into the end of the hose, best I can. No magic trick, not in the hand, they're in the end of the hose. Now I'm going to completely, just a little piece there, block up the hose, creating maximum suction and zero airflow. I'm going to completely seal this with my hand, and I'm going to turn the DC-14 on, and you're going to hear it rev up, and if I've done it right, you'll hear the suction relief valve click. It'll sound like and then I'll remove my hand and we'll see what happens. All right, I have to wait until the unit completely spools down, but I ran it all the way up to 112 inches of suction, but I had a completely blocked hose, obviously. So let's see what we have. And there you go. So high levels of suction mean practically nothing. High levels of airflow mean quite a bit. Now I'll turn the DC-14 back on and you'll see these oats suck right into the machine very low suction levels, very high airflow levels. See that go right in? That's high airflow. Well, for a Dyson, it's high airflow anyway. So that's my rant on suction versus airflow. Don't be fooled by anyone's suction claims. They mean almost nothing whatsoever. What you need is airflow. If you want to move the dirt, you have to move the air. Thanks for watching.